Hello, welcome back to Four Six Blazer. On this very wet night, my plan is to open the packet because I like knives and to tidy up one corner of my garage. I'm just going to change the way that the garage is a little bit. But anyway, onwards and upwards. The brown jiffy bag, which I still open with a nice tweed little number. Hudson Bay, courtesy of Hambo. Yes, Hambo. Right. I had to be quick to get this one. Yes, post office is well wrapped in card. Let's go that way round. My second fiction folder. Samuel Staniforth, Sheffield, England. Chris Kane, Survival Folder, I think it's called. So it's sort of like a sport peasant. Just a bit more classy. It's just chunk of my carter. Got space or lump there of steel. Pin, lanyard hole. There's a stop pin there. And a pivot pin. Nothing wrong with what I pay for it. Pick it up later. That's that's the problem in the garage. Can we sharpen it up? Red sharpen it up. Would it go with a strop? Gonna go? Is it gonna go? Not quite yet. So, project for tonight: put a work above a ledge, and it's used fresh and fresh. UK legal, that you know, Governor. Honest office ever. Going on here now. What may be the case? There was a video I watched the other day, it had Zach Wilde in it. Now, Zach Wilde is one of my all time guitar gods. Okay. Zach Wilde is about six foot two, about 250 pound, and he grows his fingernails like bear claws. He plays a Les Paul and it looks looks like a three quarter size. He's that big and he's on stage chains, huge wall of doom marshal. Now he played an acoustic doing voodoo child. And I left a comment. Basically he ripped that guitar up so much. Alright. Voodoo child. On the acoustic. I left a comment that he tore that guitar a new sound hole. It's quite well appreciated. I think on this blade, because it is used, I've got to give it a new grind. Okay, it's, it's, it needs more than a touch up. So I'm actually on there tearing it a new sound hole. Starting it off again. 
but what is apparent is this will come up to a very very nice edge it's grating it's got it's got bite to it very lean grind Just guessing. See if I'm there yet. Feel sharp. There you go. Now it cuts paper. So, as I said, hues, second hand. It got to the point where its edge had been sharpened and sharpened. I had to <coughs> lean it out, bring it back a little. So I went on the stone and literally, same direction, same blade face it and just went backwards and forwards five times two three, four five flipped it over one two three four five and then flip flop like that now back to the six thousand then to the strop now we're there now we're there so, let's say that's only got, I suppose it's only got what, 248 years left on it now. Bloody knives wearing out, eh? So there it is, my new Chris Kane survival folder. UK legal carry at home discretion. Why do they always put them bollocksy bits at the end? It's UK, illegal.